Welcome back to Infinite Innovations Tech. Guess what Mark Zuckerberg just did? Meta has finally dropped the Llama 3 model, and it's a big deal. This open source model opens up a new world of possibilities, especially regarding how well it can answer questions. This release is a game changer for the AI community. Let's investigate what we know about this exciting new addition to Meta AI. Mark Zuckerberg announced on Instagram that Meta AI is releasing a new version featuring the Llama 3 model, an advanced AI assistant accessible across Meta's apps and glasses. All right, big day here. We are releasing the new version of Meta AI, our assistant that you can ask any question across our apps and glasses. And our goal is to build the world's leading AI and make it available to everyone. Now, today we are upgrading Meta AI with Llama, our new state-of-the-art AI model that we're open sourcing. And I'm gonna go deeper on Llama 3 in just a minute, but the bottom line is that we believe that Meta AI is now the most intelligent AI assistant that you can freely use. To make Meta AI even smarter, we've also integrated real-time knowledge from Google and Bing right into the answer. This update aims to make Meta AI the most intelligent assistant available for free, integrating real-time knowledge from Google and Bing into its responses. We're also making Meta AI much easier to use across our apps. We built it into the search box that's right at the top of WhatsApp, Instagram, Facebook, and Messenger. So anytime you have a question, you can just ask it right there. And we built a new website, meta.ai, uh, for using it from the web. Meta AI now offers easier access through the search boxes in WhatsApp, Instagram, Facebook, and Messenger, along with a new website. Additionally, Meta AI introduces unique creation features like animations and high quality image generation in real time. We're also releasing a bunch of unique creation features. Meta AI now creates animations and it now creates high quality images so fast that it actually generates and updates the images for you in real time as you're typing. Uh, it's pretty wild and you can go check it out now on WhatsApp or the website. This release is part of Meta's commitment to building a leading AI and responsibly open sourcing its models, the Llama 3 models, with parameters ranging from 8 billion to 70 billion, exhibit best-in-class performance for their scale with even more prominent models in training. We are investing massively to build the leading AI, and open sourcing our models responsibly is, is an important part of our approach. The tech industry has shown over and over that open source leads to better, safer, and more secure products, faster innovation, and a healthier market. And beyond improving meta products, these models have the potential to help unlock progress in fields like science, healthcare, and more. Now let's talk about the performance of the Llama 3 model. Its benchmarks are surprisingly impressive, surpassing state-of-the-art models like the Claude 3 Sunit. This indicates that Meta is setting the bar high regarding AI development, especially considering these models are open source and readily available to developers. It's fascinating to see how Meta AI's Llama 3 compares to other models in terms of performance and overall ability. Meta is taking the lead in the race for dominance in AI development by continually updating and improving their models. This level of competition drives innovation and pushes the boundaries of what AI can achieve. But there's more to this release than just benchmarks. Meta AI has also focused on optimizing performance for real-world scenarios by developing a new high-quality human evaluation set. This ensures that the AI models excel on paper and are practical and useful for everyday tasks. After all, the ultimate goal of AI development is to create technology that enhances human experiences and capabilities. Meta's release of the Llama 3 model is a significant milestone in AI. It's a testament to the company's commitment to pushing the boundaries of technology and making AI more accessible and valuable to everyone. With Meta leading the way, we can expect to see even more exciting developments in AI in the near future. Let's break down the showdown between Llama 3 and Gemini in language models. Gemini steps into the ring as a strong contender, boasting some unique features that make it stand out from the crowd. One cool thing about Gemini is its design and efficiency, making it a versatile tool for crunching and visualizing data. It's adaptable too, meaning it can fit right into different platforms, making it a handy option for all users. 
When it comes to real-world stuff, Gemini flexes its muscles in handling all kinds of data – text, images, audio, video, you name it. Plus, it's fluent in popular programming languages like Python, Java, and C++, which is a big win. <laughs> Basically, Gemini is like your one-stop shop for processing all sorts of data across different industries. Now, let's get into the nitty-gritty of how these models compare. Llama 3 shines in accuracy and speed, leaving Gemini 1.5 Pro in the dust in various tests. But hold up! Gemini's got something up its sleeve, too. It's super efficient with resources. While Llama 3 nails it in accuracy, Gemini knows how to make the most of what it's got, using fewer resources without skimping on performance. Let's discuss where each model shines and where it might struggle. Llama 3 is the go-to for tasks needing deep language understanding, like legal documents or scientific research. On the flip side, Gemini is the champ for quick data crunching, perfect for analyzing social media vibes or interpreting customer feedback. In wrapping it up, Llama 3 nails precision and advanced language stuff, while Gemini is all about handling diverse data types like a boss. Looking ahead, as these language models keep evolving, it's not just about pushing boundaries, it's also about doing it ethically. Researchers are all about ensuring these models are fair and unbiased, so they're not just powerful but also responsible. It's all about striking that balance between innovation and keeping things above board, because the future of AI is in our hands. Let's dive into the face-off between Llama 3 and GPT-4. Buckle up because we've got quite the showdown on our hands. We'll break it down piece by piece. First up, the magic elevator test. We put Llama 3 and GPT-4 to the logical reasoning test. Surprise, Llama 3 nails it while GPT-4 fumbles the ball. This is unexpected, considering Llama 3 is rocking a mere 70 billion parameters, while GPT-4 boasts a whopping 1.7 trillion. But hold your horses. We ran this test on ChatGPT+, and GPT-4 may be playing with an older model. When we tested the newer GPT-4 on OpenAI Playground, it aced the exam. So, it's a mixed bag here. Now, onto some classic reasoning. Llama 3 and GPT-4 both crush it without even breaking a sweat. Excellent work, Meta. But then, we threw in another question to shake things up. Llama 3 gets close, but GPT-4 swoops in with the correct answer. We have to hand it to GPT-4 on this one. Moving on, we asked a simple logical question. Both models hit the nail on the head. Seeing the minor Llama 3 holding its own against big dogs like GPT-4 is pretty wild. Now for the math showdown. GPT-4 flexes its muscles and nails the problem, while Llama 3 misses the mark. No biggie though. GPT-4 has always been a math whiz. We told ChatGPT not to use the code interpreter for this one. Are you following instructions? Llama 3's got it down pat. It cranks out 10 mango-themed sentences like a pro, while GPT-4 manages 8. It looks like Llama 3 takes the crown here. All right, on to the NIH test. Even though Llama 3 doesn't have the most extended context window, it still finds the needle in the haystack. GPT-4 does it too. There are no surprises there. Llama 3 proves there is no slouch in most tests, especially in reasoning and following instructions. Math might not be its strong suit compared to GPT-4, but nobody's perfect. Meta says Llama 3's coding skills are top-notch, so that's something to look forward to. Remember, we're comparing a smaller model to the heavyweight GPT-4. And hey, Llama 3 is dense, while GPT-4 is rocking MoE architecture. Kudos to Meta for shaking things up with the Llama 3 lineup. Bottom line? Llama 3 is leveling up the game, and by open sourcing the model, Meta is closing the gap between proprietary and open source models. Once those beefier Llama 3 models drop, they will be a force to be reckoned with. So, hats off to Llama 3 for joining the AI big leagues. It's a new ball game, and Meta's playing to win. And that's a wrap for today's video. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll catch you in the next one. Remember, we love hearing your future video ideas, so drop them in the comments below. Oh, and before you go, here's a question. Which aspect of the Llama 3 versus GPT-4 comparison surprised you the most? Let us know. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to Infinite Innovations 
Tech for more insightful content on the latest tech and advancements.